I feel like there's somebody back there in our woods. I don't know, I just keep... I just get that feeling like you're being watched. It's weird. Man, you can't get the jump on Floyd. Let's just be real here. Look at these. I got these boots on. Man, Jason thinks he, he gets to test these boots first. Floyd gets to test these boots first. Floyd always gets to go first. So what's Floyd have to say about these boots? I say they're pretty nice. I'm sure Jason's gonna come up with some nonsense. What I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna sneak in there when my boy's at work. I'm gonna start wearing these boots all day. How about that? You have no idea I'm here. No, no. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Ooh, Let's give him a try here. Well, hey, Steven. How's it going, buddy? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. All right, well, welcome back to Caddy Wampus Acres. It's Jason. Got to get some uh, animals taken care of today. Deal with these chickens over here. Chickens, what is up? Hello, chickens. Whoop. It's uh, cooled off quite a bit. I had to get the old Stetson back out. Keep my, uh, my head a little bit warmer because I'm, it's not covered with long flowing locks if you will whoop all right they're good she's got these new boots new boots uh huh oh i got a tag on them oh well, i'll deal with that is it cool to wear them with the tag i don't know i like them little little new boot goof in here hey hey good morning How's everybody? How are you? Oh, coming in close. Coming in close. Well, I hope everybody's doing fantastic today. It is cooled off, which I like personally. Good morning, fellas. Um, you may notice Miyagi is not here. Miyagi is actually at a friend's farm and he is uh, breeding their does right now. We got you guys smell really bad. Go for you. Little down here. Little in here. Quag man, chill. This guy. Yeah, Quag is Luna's kid, and he acts the same way about food that she does, like a stinking maniac. All right, we need some. Um, Need some hay. What's hay looking like in your area? Um, it's it's pretty expensive here still. Um, we got the f we're still dealing with expensive fertilizer and everything else. So uh, yeah, we're still dealing with a little bit of that nonsense. We have actually paid up to twelve bucks a square bale, which is absolutely bananas. If we could grow it on our own, we would. Let's check on uh, Miss Pregnant Fiona. Wait till y'all see how big she's getting. And she, <laughs> feel bad for her, she's still got several more months. Yikes. Getting pretty plump. Pretty wide. There you are, there you are. Buford Bojangles, how is everyone? We're gonna go over um, back to the chickens that we moved in the old garden area back here. What are you guys doing for fall gardens? We are currently not growing any fall garden, um, except for, what is growing on its own, like these tomatoes. Isn't that funny? We grow ground volunteer plants better than probably anything. Chickens, you guys tipped over your food. Good, you doing okay? They're taking down this uh, cornfield. We'll be moving them little by little. Yeah. Do you have children? 
And do those children occasionally not do things the right way? So I got one good test for these boots. And his name is Moose. Moose, do you want to check out my new boots? Is that a yes? Wanna check out my new boots? There he goes. Oh, yep. Do you like my new oh my. Do you like my new boots? Oh. Do you like them? Do you like my new boots? Check them out. Check them out. Oh. Oh wow. That's not very nice. You like my new boots? Ah! Well, it definitely doesn't hurt as much as normal. If I was wearing Crocs, it'd be, the feet would be destroyed by now. You like? Hey, buddy. Hey, Hulk. How are you? It's good to see you this morning. Can I pet you? Can I pet you? Oh, yes. What a nice kitty. I think we have the best barn cats ever. What do you think? I think you too. I think we do. Bring a little uh, supplemental hay out to the girls out here. So I'm cleaning my shop. That's exciting. Doing some stuff in there. I'll show you all when I'm done. It's pretty embarrassing to show you right now. Hey, you want some hay? Here you are, lovely ladies. Luna, I was talking about you. Yeah, so Luna is, has a funny shape where she, um, that's just drip tape, I'm gonna pull all that up now that they've taken it down. Side note, but yeah, Luna looks all uh, skinny before she eats, but don't let her fool you. She is, uh, that's just her body shape. Her stomach will be all sunk in and then 15 minutes from now it'll be all huge. Francine's looking a lot better. This is the um, this has apparently been the best thing that Francine's experienced so far because she's always super skinny. And then Laurel looking good. Nothing to say. Yeah, see, Luna's trying to hog all the food. They'll get some. It's okay. They've uh, completely taking all of this weed stuff down in here looking great yeah I'll pull all this drip tape pull those uh, t-posts and trellises and we will um, get it ready for next year we'll see if we do a cover crop probably not I think I'll just till it in and tarp it everybody all right babies Tina Look how big Gina is. Isn't that incredible? She is like a week younger than these two. She's huge. Gigantic Gina. Darlene, how are you? Charlotte, you precious little thing. You look like a little, little ball of fur, don't you? Oh my. Right, boy if they could only smell you oh my goodness if they could only smell the quagginator yeah man you stink you stink let's get in here and milk and get that knocked out for the day we've dried up Jolene so we're just gonna milk uh, Veruca and Opal all right, goats are milked. Let's uh, continue with the rest of our day, huh? Good to go. So let's talk about these high C boots I have on. Um, I have had a pair of high C boots before. I still have them. So if you saw our video before, you probably saw what I think about high C boots. I do like them. I think the only issue I had run into at that time was um, the tab here on the back. I'll show you. This guy, I probably shouldn't pull on it. That was probably my fault. I feel like 
they've improved on it quite a bit um, it's a lot stronger feeling but these are great boots I've never they've never cracked they've never dry rotted uh, they have never um, I've never had any issues with them at all um, as far as water goes or anything like that so high C sent me these new boots um, these are almost knee high they're not quite that long but they're they're pretty tall the big thing about these boots are they are um, I'm gonna call it the the hundred pledge let's call it the hundred pledge I don't know that that's what high C's calling it but that's what I'm gonna call it and with that hundred pledge what they're saying is they will give you a hundred year warranty on these boots that's pretty awesome and these are 100 percent 100 percent warm and dry let's go make sure that they are 100 percent dry we're gonna we'll put it to the test because I don't want anybody to think I'm lying to them just for some boots and I will say this, uh, High C is not paying me for this. They didn't sponsor this video. They just sent me the boots. That's basically what it is. So this is water. This is real water, as you can see, not fake water. I'm going to stand in here. And uh, yeah, standing in a bucket. Um, I don't feel any water. It is almost to the tops of these like I said I didn't want to fill them up but um, standing in here I don't know I don't feel anything and they are warm because this is pretty cool water and my feet are actually staying nice and warm in here I, don't know. I got no no water on the inside that's pretty awesome let's try these guys in some other conditions let's go uh, take a little tromp through the Cattywampus Acres woods not to be confused with the 100 acre woods or is it 100 acre woods? I think that's what it is. Nice fall day. Oh, I love our woods. I love the woods all together, but this, our woods are awesome. All right, I've walked through some briars, walked around and did chores this morning. Let's uh, step in the water again. Nothing. They're dry. The pizza socks are dry. I like these things a lot, y'all. These are really nice boots. Minor size 13, and they are very tall. These ones are the blue and black guys. My other ones were shorter, like a mid rise, and they are uh, camouflage. Neoprene's a weird thing. Sometimes I don't trust it because it feels like water will go through it, but it doesn't, but uh, yeah, nothing. Like I said, they definitely um, have reinforced where I had pulled that off before. Basically, it pulled off the whole back part of here. Um, wasn't a major issue, but uh, it definitely made it stronger. It's actually uh, stitched into a piece of rubber now. But a lot of people like in the hotter months like to roll their boots down. And let me see, see if we can do that. Yep, you can do that with these, as low as you may need to go. There you go. You can roll them down, if you were wondering that. So yeah, that is the High C boot. Um, I will put all the information down in the description of the video. I love them. Uh, they're very lightweight. And remember what I said about the 100 pledge. They are 100% warm and dry, and 100 year warranty which is uh, certainly longer than I'm gonna last. Um, so yeah, a pair of boots that'll outlast you or that will be replaced to outlast you, uh, that's great. So now I've talked about these boots, how I like them. This is my second pair, really loving them. They have, I've never sprung a leak, if you will. Um, the rubber's never cracked or anything like that. They stay in our garage um, all the time. But uh, what Hi C wanted you to know is they are doing a product tester recruitment. And so, you can be uh, signed up. You can go and sign up on their website and you can get products to test yourself. And the way you can participate in that is I'm gonna put an activity link down in the description below and you yourself can become a high C product tester. The activity code for this product tester is acres just like we are cattywampus acres it is called acres a-c-r-e-s i'll try and uh, put that on the screen there and you can also get coupons for like 20 25 percent 
um, discounts on products. So that's pretty awesome. So I would recommend you signing up and becoming a product tester yourself and uh, checking out what um, I have deemed <laughs> the 100 pledge, 100% 100 warm and dry and the 100 year warranty. So make sure you go check it out. Everything will be in the description below. Yeah, that's it's high C boots. Let me get this thing back on before I get uh, bit by some red ants or something. Let's go check in on the ladies here. Hey ladies. Hey Opie girl. <laughs> Opal doesn't even want Tina to check the boots out, man. She's getting defensive <laughs> over these things. Well, it's such a beautiful day outside. Um, I hope you're enjoying a beautiful day yourself. I gotta get in uh, and get back to cleaning my workshop here. Cause, um, well, the, uh, the holidays are quickly approaching. And so don't forget, anybody who might be a little smelly in your life, um, anybody who uh, might be a little dirty, um, remember where you can go to get some amazing soap from, uh, where are they at? From these girls. Baruka, you want to tell them about the soap? You want to tell them about soap? Yeah, it's these are our, uh, our number one employees back here. Well, yeah, make sure you go to cattywampusacres.com and get yourself some soap. Chewed cud in, um, in my ear. Always remember that when you're homestead, you're homestead. We love you guys. We'll see you next time. Look at that precious little girl.